Hello and welcome to Stocks Advisor channel. Here at our channel we are looking for interesting buy opportunities for US based stocks. Today we will have a look at ZTO Express uh, Incorporated traded at New York Stock Exchange. Uh, ZTO Express Incorporated is actually a very interesting stock because it's following the very strong uptrend with some waves and deviations um, that you can see here. For example, starting from the famous COVID situation at 17 of May. Uh, of March, uh, we actually have these very nice waving trends, uh, and now looks like another wave is ended these days. And the question is, what will happen with this stock further? Will it really further go upwards, or will it uh, go further down? So, what's the future for it, and is it good stock to buy? So, to answer those questions, let's have a look first into general statistics. Um, just for information, here we have three lines depicted also on this graph. It's uh, green, blue, and red being moving averages 20, 50, and 200. And immediately what we need to remember for this stock, it's a stock with a long-term behavior pattern showing like 20, 50, 200 uh, pattern, meaning like moving average 50 is always, 20 is always at the top, 15 in the middle, and 200 is in below. This is usually a good sign for stably growing companies for long term. So uh, this means like if you're a long player, uh, you can buy almost at any moment, well, relatively at any moment this stock. And if you wait at least half a year, one year, it, you will have some reasonable profit. If you're a more mid short term player, you need to watch, of course, when the wave is ending. Uh, like for example at the beginning of May or uh, for example at the beginning of June, then you, then you will know where to buy another wave. So, uh, and we can see that the wave, actually, the last wave that started at the beginning of June seems like to be ending now and testing moving average 20 as a, as a resist. So it's volatiling already three last trading sessions. So let's see what trend it is. Uh, this trend actually has started at uh, 17 of March, a very famous black day for the for all stocks globally. But it's incredibly to see that COVID didn't impact almost this stock. It, it just was end of the wave. That's all impact that it did. It just ended the wave and then started another wave and another wave. It's incredibly growing in that sense. So it's almost free of COVID impact. And this trend, uh, long green line, the straight line, let's call it trend one. I will do it in green, uh, trend one. Uh, it was reconfirmed many times. It was reconfirmed at the beginning of May. It was reconfirmed at the end of May. It was kind of reconfirmed the 15th of June here without direct confirmation. And now we're testing it again. So it was quick, quick reconfirmation uh, yesterday with big jump upwards, but then we had the long red candle down. And now uh, we are volatiling on this level. So uh, the question is, will we really go up? And also to understand this, let's have a look at RSI index. All, every time we had a reconfirmation behavior, it was in the middle. So of RSI was about 50. Uh, also here. And when the trend started as well. Well, it was even a little bit below. And we are again in this, uh, the same zone. So it seems like we are repeating the same pattern here. Also, if you look at divergence convergence index, um, the, the last wave reconfirmation which was at the beginning of June, was also coinciding with forming a um, negative wave upwards. And now again, uh, the current wave, which ended, uh, which was at maximum actually at about 19 of June, uh, coincides with the maximum of the upwards wave on MACD. And now we have downwards wave, seems like two days ago it formed the minimum, now it seems like going to go up. So we'll have another wave which creates upwards, which creates positive pressure here. So in that sense, let's say uh, if you believe that there will be trend confirmation, it's already good to buy at this level. If due to some uh, situation, it might be still some uh, piercing further, it's still we need to remember that there is moving average 50, the blue line which is coming, and it will work as another very strong support line. Also, um, it, it won't be just a single support. There will be actually another support line in that level, this one that will work as well as support line. So it will be actually double support. It will be support one plus moving average 50. <clears throat> it will be double support, very strong, very hard to pierce through. So if this goes to that level from today's, it will be 
very nice box to buy so this will make it uh, let's say uh, if you believe the trend confirmation already buy but keep some funds for uh, for average down then this will be box number one and then if price pierces even further which is less likely of course but yeah uh, you never know how stocks will market will react it will be actually end of previous wave this this level this will be the box two to buy but most probably it will just end on the trend reconfirmation actually trend reconfirmation is already in box one so in buying box area so the, the border between box one and two will be actually probably the double support you can see uh, S1 line and uh, blue line of moving average 50. So it's very echelonated defense here and in general although some negative volatility can observe can be observed uh, overall expectation here that the trend upwards will continue for this stock. Uh, also nicely confirmed with smooth growing uh, moving average 200 here the red line. So that's it for ZTO. I also would like to uh, remind you that we have um, available for Android devices free mobile uh, application that follows the entry uh, the, the list of um, stocks that were discussed at our channel plus their entry points uh, so you can download this application for Android devices later we also extend it for iOS devices it's a free application you just watch free video then you can have your list of latest 16 stocks with their entry points and uh, being the number or actually the boundary between box one and box two. So this way in your pocket you always will have your uh, list and you can always check it when you are um, trading if you want to so you don't need always to come back to the channel. And then if you want to see a precise exp uh, explanation per given stock you are always to come to the channel, find the appropriate video and watch it. That's it for ZTO and also please check our free application. Thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe to our channel.